if you're not going to implement what you've come up with or what you've found out during a coaching session, then you might as well not turn up. In between coaching meetings, uh, my coach and I didn't, didn't communicate too much. Most of our communication in between meetings was scheduling the next. Uh, but a lot of the time, what my coach was fantastic at was following up. So, you know, either immediately afterwards or a couple of days later, she would send me an article or a, a tool for goal setting and, and tracking that we'd talked about. And um, and that would pull me back into, into thinking about it. And then I would email, I came out of one which was all about relationships and about a relationship at work that was really broken. And she was saying to me, do you like this person? I was like, no, I hate them. I don't, like, I don't want to deal with them. She, goes, she was like, so what aren't you doing? I was like, well, I'm not putting any time into it. She goes, well, that's something you should be doing, shouldn't you? And I was like, yes. Yeah. So begrudgingly, I went back to the office, set up a meeting. I've since had multiple meetings with this person. Our relationship is getting better. I'm putting effort and I'm putting time into it. And then I would email her and go, you were right. I was right. Um, and then we would get into just a funny conversation. But it was always I'd go and email and I'd check in with her at the end of the day. Um, if you're not going to implement what you've come up with or what you've found out during a coaching session, then you might as well not turn up. So the coaching sessions are amazing, but it's actually the biggest impact is what happens after each co coaching session. Um, so we would agree on what we needed to do, what he needed to do, what I needed to do. He would send me kind of processes or different um, snippets or YouTube clips and then I would walk away with what my actions were for each, after each session. Um, it was just a quick email, um, sometimes it would be a call just to check in how we're going and then at, at the next coaching session we would discuss where I got to with each, or where each of us got to with each of the actions and then agree on the actions for the next one. Accountability is a big area for focus, I think, when you guys are going through this journey because there's no point going through the theory and not actually putting it into practice. And coaching really helps with accountability. In terms of being accountable, I think everybody is different. So your coach will work out with you what your hot buttons are in terms of making progress. And Oscar figured out pretty quickly that I'm the sort of person that doesn't take a billion notes and you know do a billion check-ins. I'm very organic in the way I do things. He'll probably laugh because I say that all the time. But a simple text from him three days later, just to get me reflecting on what we've talked about, worked for me. It was just about reminding, centering, and making sure what we talked about is actually being put into practice. 